Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today's episode is part two of yesterday. Um, it's a different night, obviously, and uh, for the next couple days, we're going to be putting one of them out every day. Uh, I know it's a little bit different, but I'm trying to give you guys more content than ever before. Uh, I just want to thank everybody. We are up to 60 subscribers, and uh, I can't be more prouder than that. Obviously, it's a long ways away from the 1,000 subscriber mark, but you know what we just appreciate any support we can get and we thank you guys because without you we wouldn't be able to do this so also uh we'll be working on my car today dad's car is still at a standstill and sorry if it's loud it's florida and uh it decided to rain so uh, but anyway stay tuned we're gonna show you what went wrong with my car All right, everybody, as you can see, the new bumper's on. It looks a little better than the last one, except where it's not black, but I think I'll be able to live with it. Um, so another thing that happened is right here. I blew this vent, just like this one, off at uh, Marion County with the bull ring, and then I proceeded to run it over. So as you can see, we got a lot of uh, um, mud and stuff back in here because of the oil. And what do you know if there's rain again? So stay tuned, we'll come back. All right, so as I was saying, well, we were rudely interrupted by the rain. Missing one of these. The other one stayed on, but I went ahead and fixed all the problems and i uh, got new valve covers with the crossover up here and i'll show you those here in a second um but and another thing that happened was uh, i don't know if you can see it because it is dark in here but right here on my fuel valve uh, fuel valve the uh, handle switch uh fell off so uh, i'm pretty sure i got a replacement one of those and we're gonna install that on there today too also uh Speaking of the subscribers and stuff, uh, again, thank you guys who have subscribed and liked all our videos. Uh, me and Corey was gonna do something special for our 50 subscriber mark, and we were gonna do that at uh, Marion County. Unfortunately, uh, we had Corey bring his suit and everything like that, and I was gonna have him jump in the um, sprint car and take it out for a few laps to record it and give him some insight what it's like for to be in my car and on the track and the surfaces and stuff like that. And then, Obviously, I was going to try to jump in his car whenever possible and go out there and run some laps. Uh, but when Corey got in my car, he ended up actually getting hurt. He hurt his knee in a grocery getter about a year ago, almost exactly. And he got knocked out and everything like that and ended up breaking his knee. Well, somehow or another, I wasn't around when he did it, but when he was trying to get in my car, uh, his knee popped and uh, pretty much laid him up for the rest of the day, which is why you didn't see him very much on the video. So, uh, since we got 60 subscribers, I've been talking to him and we're trying to uh, come up with something that would be fun and exciting to film and uh, we might do it tomorrow, um, which is Saturday, and uh, do something fun. Maybe you guys will enjoy it too. Uh, also, um, not to be that guy or nothing like that, but uh, if you would like to see our channel grow and possibly donate or something like that, uh, we do have a donation button on our page. Uh, again, we're not asking for anything per se. It, everything does help. Also, I set up something with uh, Shane Butler over at TCB Speed. If you're uh, worried about donating on the line and stuff like that, um, you're more than welcome to call TCB Speed South with the number I put on there and um, just tell him it's for uh, Hollywood and uh, he knows everything I need if you'd like to donate that way. That way it's direct to the source and you know it's going straight to the cars if you are worried about that. 
again if you don't no big deal i hope you still enjoy it and uh we'll still be putting out content regardless all right as you can see i got the valve covers on there they are not all the way bolted down i thought i had the right um, bolts but i did not they're either too long or too short and uh i need to get some the right tube but you can kind of get the idea of the difference between the old ones and the new ones uh they're in the middle of two breathers and um, like i said that project's not done yet but it's you get, you get the idea from it how it's supposed to look and everything like that so we shouldn't have no oil blow by or anything like that but uh on to the next project all right so the next thing we're gonna be doing is uh putting another fuel valve on here just like so and then it gets this nut put on there and then it's gonna open and close i think that's the way it goes on there says fuel yep they don't go that way so uh, fuel's on there so it'd be on off so yeah it goes there we'll put this on kind of hard to do and pull the camera at the same time bear with me and then all I got to do is tighten that right there and then that job's done alrighty they are done well they're not done I gotta get the right parts or the right bolts for it and because uh, I either had too long or too short of bolts um, it happens sometimes that's why I didn't stop by the park store on the way up here to get any because I thought I had them that's what I get for thinking uh, that and the fuel valve's done there's some other odds and ends and clean up we got to do on this car to get it ready because uh, our next race is August 1st at East Bay uh, if you're in the state of Florida or you're not in the state of Florida and you want to go to that race it'll be a pretty cool show um, East Bay's fun it's usually pretty bumpy and it makes for some interesting racing and uh the confidence i'm building here lately has uh, got me excited um uh, i ain't gonna say on here what my expectations is but i've told everybody that knows me what my expectations are and uh i hope i can make it happen um so anyway um dad's car here we still got a little bit to go on it uh before it's back up uh i think he's in talk with tcb speed south right now about getting a new one of those that's his deal i can't do it for him but uh it'd probably be good at, that he does it because i'll make the bill real expensive real quick it's easy to spend other people's money um but anyway so until next time again thank you for all your support and we couldn't do it without you um man i mean i can't say nothing more than that it's just we without you guys the fans and people at the track we wouldn't have a reason to do it um so until next time stay tuned we're always getting faster it's going to start getting fun shortly <laughs>